Hi, my name is Alex and welcome back to Backlog Games and our playthrough of Stardew. Continuing from last episode, we're starting now day 7, but just after I went to sleep after last episode, we see what we earned from the day before. And we got 470 gold from the foraging items we got from the beach that we unlocked. So that's massive. If we can get something similar to that every day, that's huge. It's way more. I mean, consider I need to catch 10 fish, which would pretty much take me all day to get that. So I'm happy with that. So we're starting day seven. So my goal today is twofold. I want to try and get the a bag. Oh, Queen of Sauce. What's that? Greetings. It is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe from my secret cookbook. This week's dish, stir fry. Perfect way to get some healthy greens on your plate. Saute the greens and a little sesame oil and make sure to add plenty of fresh ginger and garlic. Now breathe deeply. Oh, that's good. So I learned how to cook stir fry. So I'm guessing in crafting maybe? No. Collections perhaps? No. Huh. Skills perhaps? No. Inventory. I don't know. Maybe it's just in... It's got to be in crafting. Maybe there's separate sections. No. Field snack is here, but I, I can make surf right now, apparently. So, oh, that's right. It's a raining day, which is great. So I can't, I don't have to worry about picking that up. What I do need to worry about, and I was reading, was the scarecrow stuff. So basically, crows can eat my crops overnight if, I um, if I don't have a scarecrow built so to do that first I need to have 50 wood which is not that difficult to come by what is going to be difficult to come by though is I need one coal which I currently don't have any of so I've gotten the coal before and I think I got it from just harvesting stone on my farm so I am going to keep I think I'm gonna just pull down until when I get 50. Once I get 50 wood, I'm gonna pull down. Okay, so I'm almost there. So I can get there just from picking up some of these loose logs here, and I'll have my 50. Okay, so that's my 50. So now let's worry about stone, and hopefully, we're gonna get a, um, a coal pop out from one of them. So, no such luck yet. Um, I actually don't have any space, so let's take our maple and let's keep planting. Let's continue our row of trees we were doing here. So one there, one... Can I not plant that there for some reason? Let's see, I need to get rid of those and then I can plant it. Yeah, okay, so I can plant that there. This, I don't know how come that's there, but... Yeah, the rest of the trees are growing okay. So let's keep on our stone mission. And I'm hoping one is going to pop up soon. If not, I guess I could try the mines, which are to the north. Let's see if one comes out of there. But I'm pretty sure I got one from just messing around in my base before. But it doesn't seem to want to work anymore. Come on, give me a coal. Uh, oh yeah, I got one. So I actually didn't even notice. So we can now make our scarecrow, I believe. So let's go into crafting. Yeah, there we go. So scarecrow, one coal, 20 fiber. So let's make this and we can put him there. So now with our scarecrow, I don't know, like, I don't know how is the best place to place it. I think it has pretty big coverage. So because I have my crops here, I'm going to want to put it, I don't know if I want to put it like right here. I don't know if I can walk through it or not because I don't necessarily want to have it on my path if I can't. But let's try it right there. So 
Okay, I haven't encountered any crows yet. It talks to us. It's a pretty fancy scarecrow. So I am guessing that this covers that length. Um, okay, prevents crows from attacking your crops. Has a limited radius, about eight tiles. So, I mean, one, two, three, four. Yeah, that's more going to cover here. I could probably even move it down slightly and still have it cover all of them. I wonder if I can move it, though, without it. Ah, yeah, I can. Perfect. So I think I could put it there. And if I have this, um, is that? No. So that's about one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. So I think it will cover all of my crops, which is good. So now that we have that done, let's look at our... Right. So we need another 50 to build a chest, which is a lot. Um, what we'll do is let's create some more stone let's create all the stone we have and let's continue our path because it looks cool yeah we can make it on the grass so let's make it to our front door there and we can then make it down we can continue oh we can't oh yes we can so we can build it up here oh that looks kind of cool I don't know if it's functional, but that looks kind of cool. And then we can continue it here. I guess we can have our rows. We can continue our rows out even further. So that's neat. We have about half energy for today. Oh, wait. Someone's... Okay, so we're done with this advancement. Oh, it's 100 gold because we made the scarecrow. So that's done. So the next thing is delivery and that. So I think maybe I should worry about building the chest let's see if I can't get 50 without making my energy go down uh, is it just me or am I chopping faster I think maybe my foraging skills going up help okay so that I have a little bit more oh I got an acorn as well and that gave me 18 wood just for that one tree so at this rate, I probably need two more trees and there's stumps and that will give me the 50 which I can use to craft a chest. And I think I'll just put the chest in my house. Okay, that's there. One more. Okay, one more tree. Hopefully I'll be fine on energy. Come on. Okay, let's... I'm not gonna... I'm gonna see if this isn't enough right here. Is that... Oh, okay, one more, so that's fine. Okay, so we have that there. So what I'm going to do, let's plant our acorn down here. Why is it not letting me plant it? Okay, there we go. What's this? That is a pine cone, so that's another tree. Okay, so let's continue our row of trees there. What I'm going to do is inside, maybe I should put it outside, uh, I don't know, I don't want robbers to take my stuff. I'm going to build a chest and put it right here. Okay, perfect. So, okay, so this works well. So I can put my sap, I can put all the stuff in there. Um, pickaxe, the scythe, I use this a bit, but maybe I don't need to have it on me because I only use it at the farm. So maybe I can just pull this stuff out of here when I need it uh, for now I'll hang on to it but oh no, I'll, I'll take that but that frees up a ton of inventory so I don't have too much just 220 so what I don't have that much energy what I'm gonna go and do we got a lot done around the farm today which I like but what I'm gonna go and do first is I'm gonna go and forage the beach from what we would collected before and then if I have enough energy, I'm going to go check out this mine because it's still relatively early. I still have about another six or seven hours before I want to go to sleep. So it's only going to take me an hour or two to finish with the beach, I'm hoping. Okay, let's check this site. Ah, oh, that's 50 right there. Okay, so let's get that and let's see what else we have. No, nothing else here, but let's go over to out here, which was really good last time. 
And it appears that there's nothing on the beach. <laughs> so it tricked me last time into thinking, oh, I guess there's one. Oh, who's that? Oh, Mariner, I've got this old amulet to sell, but something tells me you're not ready for it, lad. What's that supposed to mean? Alright, so, yeah, out here was not very good today. We only got one muscle or whatever, which is not that much. Let's see if there's anything. No. Nothing else out here, so... I guess it varies from day to day. It's not necessarily that it's gonna be awesome. Okay, we still have a bit of energy. Oh, wait, you know what? Today is Duncan's birthday. I wonder if we can't... Not Duncan, the old dude, the old guy from the fishing hut. I wonder if, oh, who's that? We'll check him after. Um, I thought it was his birthday today, but maybe not. This is not allowing me to do anything. If I fish and you'll be able to attach bait and tackle to the line. It causes fish to bite faster, tackle to make your job a lot easier when reeling fish in. Okay, well, I guess maybe I was wrong. What's this out here? Miniature model of a frigate. A tackle box. Okay. Alright, so let's go. It's getting late. This guy's actually heading back in. I think he's. Alright, he's Sebastian. We've met him before. If you're lucky, you might see a frog in this weather. Well, thanks for that lovely advice, Sebastian. What I'll do is let's head back. I want to see whose birthday it was today, because I'm pretty sure it was someone's birthday. And that's on the board by the general store. Hey, who's that? Oh, it's Alex. Hey, Alex. I'm Alex. All he has to say is, hey, come on. Okay, so let's check. Okay, help wanted, nothing posted today. Where is it? Okay, this is the calendar. It's not letting me read it for some reason. Okay, oh, the doctor's going home. Hey doc, what's up? I'm struggling to make ends meet. I don't have enough patience. Well, I'm sorry. Okay, so how do we get to up there? We can go right and then up. So let's go that way. I think we should have enough time to at least check it out. Is this the right way? No, I passed it. I have to go up here. Let's see. Yeah. This is the way. Oh, my energy is so surprisingly good. Huh, that looks like it's... Can I chop you down? No, I cannot. Okay, so let's keep going this way. I think this is right by... Okay, we should be able to go right from here. This is that... We've been here before to that house. But I don't think we were able to progress up this way very far. Right, so... This is the mine. Okay, so let's see who this old dude is. He's Marlon. I haven't met him before. Oh, it's like a cutscene. I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably a good ore down there. But a dark place, undisturbed for so long, I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you're finding. Ooh, there might be mobs and monsters. Here, take this. You might need it. Hey, I got a sword. That's awesome. You received a rusty sword. It's okay. I'll give them tetanus. Name's Marlon, by the way. I run the Adventurers Guild right outside. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself, and I might think about making you a member. Okay. So I guess, did it count that I met Marlon? Okay, no. Explore the mine. Reach level 5 in the mines. That gives me something. And introductions. Huh. It actually didn't count as me meeting Marlon. So, I don't know what all this stuff is. I can't go that way. I can't go that way unless maybe I can. Your pickaxe isn't strong enough to break that yet. But I can. Can I go down? Yes, I can. I probably should get my sword out just in case anything. Huh, what's this? Can I mine this stuff? 
Oh, yes, I can. Okay, so it's just stone. All right, I need to be careful because my energy is actually going now. It's interesting because here now I have health. Which means that bad guys probably are going to be in here somewhere. I really... Oh, that's another level. Okay. My energy is getting dangerously low. So I am actually going to head back now. Maybe I'll go down one more. Just... Oh, my energy is super low. Oh, look. There are mobs down here. I'm guessing just swinging my sword is going to take... Not really. Oh. Oh, these guys are mean. Get away from me. Reminds me of Terraria again. They're the cutest mobs ever. Oh, you just draw. Oh, I'm not at another level. Okay, so I'm gonna. Alright, I gotta check one more. Let's see what this looks like. I actually don't have room. Oh, look at my health, though. You're starting to feel exhausted. That's not... Oh, actually, I had algae. I didn't realize. Let's eat that. That's going to give us a little bit of energy, which at this point, we need all we can take. So that gave us health. And what's this we just got? Oh, it's a copper ore. A common ore that can be smelted into bars. That's kind of cool. So what I'm going to do, let's, let's leave the mine. There is a ton of stuff to do in this. This is like a whole different aspect of the game. The old dude said he was going to be outside. So let's see if he's in here. Oh, it's really late. Okay, proven adventurers only. So it's actually not going to allow us to get to him. There is something else out here, which um, I'm not going to look at my eyes. It looks like I'm getting sleepy. So let's see if we can make it back home without passing out. I wonder if we could sleep at someone else's house. Um, is this the way to go? I think so. Yes. So let's head on back home before we pass out, hopefully. Because, yeah, my eyes look like I'm getting pretty exhausted. Uh, it's been a long day. I got a lot accomplished, though. So I got the chest built i got the scarecrow built i managed to go and look for oh, am i going the right way no let's go this way um, i managed to check out the mine like there's a lot of stuff we managed to get done so the mine adds so like i can farm of course but then there's fishing or i can spend time in the mine which is just another huge time suck. So it just depends on what we want to do, what we think is the most, is the best for um, making money. But I'm thinking what I'm going to do is just do farming in the beginning of every day. And then maybe I'll try out mining for a little while because that seems kind of fun. Oh, it's 11.40. It's super late. All right. Turn this back on. Oh, before I go to sleep, I have to put these stuff to mail. So let's put. Oh, I'm falling asleep. Oh, that's not good. All right. Let's put that in there. Let's put that in there. I'm going to keep the stone. I'm going to keep the sap. And I'm going to keep the copper ore. I got to figure out how to smelt the copper. But I'm going to put the sap in here because I have the rest of the sap. And why not? Let's stick the stone in there as well and the copper. No, the copper I'll hang on to. Alright, so thanks for watching. Uh, we got quite a bit accomplished this episode. And we're going to continue on the mining farming train next time out for what will be day 7, I believe. Or 8, I'm not sure. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe if you're enjoying this. And I will see you next time.